Hello everybody, hope you guys are doing fantastic, I know I am. In today's video we have another outfit request, though I got it last week and I'm finally getting on to do it, so I apologize it took that long. Um, but thank you for the request and let's get started on it. Okay, so obviously you're going to start out with the logos, so you're going to want to put on your C2 Keep outfit and save it in our C2 slot. Then go down to the racing suits with the logos you want on the outfit. You should try it on. And choose whatever logos you want. I'm gonna go with the green racing suit. And put that in our C1 outfit slot. Head over the tops. Scroll down to the two fine t-shirts. And we're looking for the yellow t-shirt. Should be 58 out of 70. And put that in a merch slot. All right, so our merch slot, our C1 and our C2. Those put on the C1 fast. outfit, put on an Israel parachute. Let the game save before disconnecting your Wi-Fi with Netcut. Or lagging your Wi-Fi, I should say. Alright, so once we load into C2, or on our second console, equip the C2 outfit, which should be the uh, C2 Keep. Put on Israel Parachute, let it save before leaving the story mode. And then once we have done that, once you're back on console 1, just take off the parachute and unlag your game. Alright, so we just find them looking like this. The outfit should have the logo that you wanted on it. Now to start any merging mission, I have linked in the description. And as always, invite a friend or an to join. And make sure the clothing is set to player own clothing. Alright, so we had started it up. And then once we load in the job, we're going to have to go once to the left, once to the right, or once to the right, then once to the left, depending on where your merge slot is. It should merge over. Now just go save it in your apartment. Alright, so just go ahead and save this outfit in our C1 slot. We're going to be working on merging the belt over before we do anything else. One. Have your friend or an alt blow themselves up to avoid from going to bad sport by leaving the missions. Alright, so now we're just going ahead over to the pants section. We're going to be putting on the stockings that we're going to be using for this outfit. So I down the stockings. And we are equipping the black heart stockings. Did you find your size? Now don't worry about the shoes, we'll be merging them on later. So go ahead and go to the top section. Utility vests, and we're looking for the peach plate carrier. I'm sorry, I'm not on a PS5, so it's kind of laggy right now. Alright, it should be 43 out of 75. Now we're going to be setting that in our C1 slot. Now put on any heist coverall uh, hazmat suit outfit. And go to a telescope. Alright, so I'm sure you know how to do this, but in case, just in case, run past it. Go right on the D-pad. Hold the interaction menu. Equip the outfit that we just made. Walk away and the mask should merge over. Now go to the mask store or any clothing store to save it. Alright, so go ahead and save it in the same outfit slot. Now before we join Titan of a job, this is a really important part. Equip the outfit around 15 times. It will um, help avoid us from spawning in with the Balakov mask. Because if you spawn in with that mask on it, you'll have to close the entire application and do the just success we just did again. So equip it 15 times or more. 
and that's sort of a titan of a job. Alright, if we did everything correctly, we should spawn in like this. The Peach play carry should be all the outfit, and we should have the gas mask hat still on. And then just go to any gun store to save the outfit. Alright, so once you made it to a gun store, just save the outfit in the same slot. I usually save it three times just to be safe. Now we're going to be equipping an outfit with the gun or the belt that we want on the outfit. For me, it's going to be this gun belt. So just equip the outfit and then lead the mission. Now you're just going to want to start up the merging job again. Invite your friend or not to join. And as always, play your own clothing. Alright, so when you load in and you try to merge the belt over, you're going to realize that the belt won't show in the outfit. But that's completely fine, just do what I do and you'll get the belt on the outfit. You see the belt's on the outfit, so just ready up, it's fine. Now what we're going to do is walk around in the job for 15-ish seconds. Alright, so once you do that, just either lead the mission and blow yourself up to avoid going to that sport. Alright, so once you spawn back online, you want to go to your personal vehicle that's a car or a street vehicle. Bikes do not work doing this. Wait till it lets you register as a CEO. Alright, so you want to hop in your car or a street vehicle you found. CEO, management style, one still left, one's to the right, get out of the car, and you see the belch from return over. Now just go save it. Alright, so when you can just go ahead and save it if you want to, just to be safe, but we're going to go ahead over to the uh, shoe section, heels. We are looking for the leather studded boots. Put that in our C1 slot. Now for the C2 outfit, head down to boots, and we're looking for the coffee knee-high boots. Sixty-four out of ninety-two. Go. Save this in our C2 slot. Now, you, if you don't have the pink plain high tops on any outfit, just head over to the desk right here. Look for stuntman suits. We're going to be equipping the pink stuntman suit. And just save that in our merge slot. Alright, so once you've done that, just equip the C1 outfit. Apply a classic parachute. Let the game save before lagging your Wi-Fi. Alright, once you load it in on console 2, we equip the C2 outfit. Classic parachute. Let the game save before leaving the story mode. And once you've done that, once you're back in console 1, just take off the parachute and unlike your game. Alright, so we should spawn in with the same outfit that we, um, that we put in the C1 slot. Uh, go ahead and join any merging mission. And as always, for your friend out to join and make sure the clothing is on player owned. Now just go once to the left, once to the right, or once to the right, once to the left, depending on what your merge slot is, and ready up. The shoes should have merged on to the stockings, like so. Now I just go save it in your apartment. Now if you have any accessories to merge like I do, like a badge or anything like that, go ahead and save this outfit in our C1 slot. If you do not have any accessories and don't just or just don't want to merge any, then go ahead and skip this part. That's completely fine.
Now, like I said earlier, if you're not merging accessories like I am, then just go ahead and skip this part. But if you are, go to accessories, bangles, and equip the floral bangle. And put that in our C1. Now for our C2, you're going to want to put on these earrings. Let me find them real quick. The white hoop earrings, they should be 44 out of 44. Let's set that in our C2 slot. Now just put any outfit with the accessories you want on this outfit in our merge slot. I'm going to be merging over this IA badge set. So put that in our merge slot. Once you've done that, just equip the C1 outfit. Equip a classic parachute. Let the game save before lagging your Wi-Fi connection with Netcut. Alright, so once you load back on uh, console 2, we're going to be equipping the C2 outfit. Putting on a classic parachute. Let the game save before leaving the story mode. Once you've done that, go back to console 1 and take off the parachute and unlock your game. Once you look back online, we should be looking like this. Now just start up any emerging job. Invite your friend or alter join as always and make sure some player own footing. Alright, so just merge everything over. If you did everything correctly, the badge or whatever you're merging will be on the outfit, so just save it in your apartment. Alrighty, so just save this outfit in a um, spare spot, because we're going to be working on the top part of this outfit now. I'm going to save it down here, come and get later. Then have your alt or your friend blow themselves up to avoid going into bad sport. Alright, so if you're wanting to merge armor to this outfit as well, uh, do what I do. If you're not, then skip this part. You know, for me, I am going to be turning this half armor right here into pink. Now, I understand not everyone has this glitched armor texture. So, as always, you can just use, uh, say, this armor. Or any other armor you have that can you flip to pink. But if you're not wanting armor, then as I said, just go ahead and skip this part. Alright, so I'm going to let this slot stay here since I don't need to resave it. We're going to be putting on a random outfit. Take your time. Applying uh, the... Hold on, i got to see what it's named again. The super heavy armor. Now this will flip the color armor to pink. Go over to parachutes. And put on a an Israel parachute. Let the game save before lagging your Wi-Fi connection. Alright, so once you load down on console 2, equip the C2 outfit, which should be the one with the armor. Apply an Israel parachute. Let the game save before leaving the story mode. Now once you've done that, once you're back on console 1, just take off the parachute and unlag your game. Alright, so if everything was done correctly, you should see the armor has turned pink. Now all you want to do is go save it. Alright, so we're going to be putting this armor in our merge slot. I can see you wearing that. You're going to want to go to the top section. Scroll down to the design designer sport jackets. And we are looking for the Green Leaves Guffy Puffer. I think it's somewhere near the top. Yep, 4 out of 27. Interaction menu, apply a heavy body armor. This will allow us to merge the armor we just flipped to the outfit. And save it as C1, not C2, sorry. 
We have that in multiple colors. Now we're going down to gun running t-shirts. Equip the last one, which is the blue digital t-shirt. Play that in our C2 slot. And then once we saved them, you're going to want to equip the C1 outfit, which should be the guest stylized Guffy Puffer with the armor. Or sorry, that leaves Guffy Puffer. Apply an Israel parachute. We'll let the game save before lagging your Wi-Fi with netcut. Alright, so once loaded on console 2, equip the C2 outfit. Equip a Israel parachute. Let the game save before leaving the story mode. Help. Shut up, Ron. Alright, once you're back on console one, just take off the parachute and unlag your game. Alright, if we did everything correctly, we just spawn in with the pink adversary uh, camo top. Now to show any emerging mission, invite a friend to join in as always and make sure it's on player owned clothing. Alrighty, so when we load in, just merge over the armor. Go save it in your apartment. Alright, so we can go ahead and put this in our, C, uh, our merge slot. Merge. We only got one merge left to before we can complete this outfit. Yay! As always, make sure your friend blows himself up so we uh, don't get put in bad for leaving the job. All right, so you're just gonna want to equip the outfit we built earlier. Go to body armor and put on the heavy body armor. Got a hat, biker helmet. Biker helmets, sorry. And you're gonna want to equip the Stars and Stride Stone, 13 out of 30. And save this outfit in our C1 slot. Now, this part is up to you if you're using the Bluetooth helmet or the truck off hats. Go ahead and equip it so we can uh, flip it to pink. So, what you want to do is go over to your, um, your personal vehicle, it has to be a car or a truck. No bikes, which means no oppressors. Hover over the C2 keep outfit. Which is sit in the car, equip the outfit, leave the car, and the helmet will be merged over to the outfit. Now we're going to head over to the pants section. Take a look around. Cargo pants. And we are looking for the dark woodland cargo. I think I may have passed it. Yep, 23 out of 49. Now head over to the shoe section, go to skate shoes, and equip the white two-tone backside. This will uh, allow us to keep the shoe color by default. It works on any outfit you're making with Beth. So save this outfit in our C2 slot. I just equip the C1 outfit, put on a pair of glasses, and the Israel parachute. Let the game save before lagging your Wi-Fi connection. Alright, once you load it in on console 2, equip the C2 outfit. Apply a pair of glasses, and then put on the Israel parachute. Let the game save before leaving the story mode. Once you're back on console one, just equip the outfit. It'll get rid of the parachute and the glasses at once. Mine, we should be looking like this. Helmet would change color, pants and shoes are the same, same logos. And to start up any emerging mission, invite a friend or not to join and as always, make sure to play your own clothing. Hey. All right, so now you just wanna merge everything over. 
You ready up? Go save it in your apartment. So now you can just go ahead and save it in any slot you want since this is a completed outfit. Let's see if I can put some cuffs on here though, because I don't like how there's only one spiked cuff there. Yep, so go ahead and delete everything else. Save it wherever you want to. And this is the completed outfit. I would merge on some of the pink adversary gloves, but it's not guaranteed that these arms right here won't disappear. Because most of the times you merge them, they disappear. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed, and thank you for watching. And if you wouldn't mind subscribing, it means a lot to me and it's free. I post have content a lot and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye bye.